hasn't been a conscious choice to make movies about heroes, but it's an interesting story about regular people doing exceptional things. It's not the common man, just three guys that grew up together. They were put in a position to have to act quickly. Go! Because it could have been a major disaster. There was 500 people on that train that day. I've looked at a lot of actors, good actors too, but I kept looking at the guys and I kept looking at their faces. And finally one day I just said, do you guys think you could play yourself? And the more they thought about it, the more they got with it. And it turned out that they had a lot of natural gift. And it also was a bit of a catharsis for them to go back and relive the moment. I just look around sometimes and I'll look at Mr. Eastwood like across the room and I'll be like, oh my God, I'm standing here playing myself in a Clint Eastwood movie about my life. It's kind of like living it twice. We've experienced something amazing, so it's coming full circle. We get to relive two years ago how we were, so it's cool to see how far we've came in between. The whole thing has just been kind of mind-blowing for me. And to be referred to as heroes is kind of a trip, and to be honest, we're just incredibly grateful that we survived that day. It was just kind of acting on impulse and God watching out for us or something because we made it out alive. It was their experience. I mean, I knew what I wanted to shoot, but the adventure was for real. It was their story because it was real life.